happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday week, son. It's your birthday week. You're going to be one years old. Can you believe that? This has been the best year. The best year of my life because of you. It's been so fun holding you and kissing you and cuddling you and smelling your baby breath and changing those icky diapers because of you. Jackson and I are just having a snack. I cut up some apples for me and Jackson is eating some peaches and Jackson just full blown took my apple away. And he's never had an apple and he's actually being really good about just taking little bites with his teeth and it's kind of cute. I think he kind of likes it. You like that? Mm -hmm. Do you like uh. it? <laughs> cheese. That was your teeth. Say cheese. You know what I was thinking to myself, Ellie? What? I was thinking to myself, and I said, Self, these poles that we have are certainly not even close to as long as we need to go pole vaulting with. No, not at all. We need to take these poles back and we need to get longer poles so we can pole vault properly with. There's no way we're gonna pole vault 20 feet two inches with this pole and break the world record, okay? There's just no way we can do that. This pole is as tall as I am, maybe just a tan pole, I don't know. But we need at least a 17 foot pole if we're gonna pole vault 20, two, 20 feet two inches and break the world record. Should go get, you said 22 inch pole? Something like that, yeah. You go get like a 30 inch pole. 30 inch pole? You mean 30 feet pole? I don't know what I'm talking about. See, Ellie is a pole vaulting amateur. I am a pole vaulting master. I'm a master of the pole vault. I actually studied a long time about pole vaulting and I studied under um, the Petrov model. If you guys even know what that even means, it's a technique that the previous world record holder, still record holder in my heart, Sergei Bubka from the Ukraine used. He broke the world record like 35 times. But of course it's, you know, centimeter by centimeter. But are you gonna be a pole vaulter when you grow up, Jackson? Huh? Is daddy gonna teach you how to pole vault? I really want to. Because I think pole vaulting is such an awesome sport. There's, it's very technical. You have to be very strong. It's like gymnastics on a stick. When I said that out loud, but I thought of something they different. But high schools really anymore. They, they, actually, actually... they actually are starting to bring it back. There was a point in time where I think almost all Utah high schools had pole vaulting banned because um, people would keep landing on their heads and hurting themselves. Pole vaulting is actually a very safe sport if you know how to be safe. The reason that so many injuries happen is because people don't know what they're doing and that's why you need a coach. That's why a coach is so important. I'm a coach! You were a coach. I was a coach. I coached the women at the BYU pole vaulting team. Um, let's go get a pole. Let's get some poles. Are you gonna be a pole vaulter when you grow up? Uh -huh. Huh? I guess you have that choice. The choice is yours, Jackson, but I'm gonna try and force it on you a little bit. So I'm here at Walmart and Jared's looking at ink and I have a few groceries that I need. Oh yes, I do need animal crackers. <laughs> but I was just thinking, I ought to start stocking up on diapers now. I wish I would have done that with Jackson and if I had the room in our place, I probably would have. But we had such a small place that I didn't. So now that maybe we, I could put the diapers in the garage or in the closet, I actually want to start buying diapers now and I kind of have a feel for what I'll need from with Jackson. Like I won't need like a hundred boxes of newborns, maybe just one, you know, or something like that. So anyway, maybe not today. I don't know, I'll see what Jared says, but it'd kind of be nice to start getting them now so we don't have to buy them when the baby comes. Oh, and by the way, my favorite is Huggies. <laughs> I've tried a lot of the brands. I've tried the uh, Walmart brand, Costco brand, Pampers. What else have I tried over here with Jackson? I don't think I've ever tried Loves actually. Maybe I should try those for Jackson and see what I think. I don't think I've tried those, but I do love Huggies. Those are probably my favorite. Marco! Polo! Marco! Polo! Polo! <gasps> Polo! You found us. Oh, gee, look what I got for you. This is for your birthday. <sighs> Thank you. Jack, no, it's for Jax. It's for your birthday to have a couple of treats. Animal crackers in my soup. 
monkeys and rabbits look a loop. It is that time of season again that my nails always look beautiful. Do you guys want to know the secret? It's called Girls Night Every Monday. Thank you, Bachelor. <laughs> we have not turned on cable. And I don't know how long. I do not remember the last time Jared and I put on a show other than maybe a movie during the holidays. But we haven't watched TV. We watch YouTube. YouTube is our TV. And so every time The Bachelor comes on, every time the season comes on, that is kind of my little getaway show. I do like the Kardashians, but I don't keep up with them. I don't keep up with keeping up with the Kardashians. But I like The Bachelor, so I always sit, file my nails, paint them. It's my time to relax, and I love it. So tonight I made my yummy scalloped potatoes, and I have green beans going, and I just made a lemon sauce for the top of my lemon squares. So my little lemon cake is in there, and I had to use lemons, and so guess what? Jackson gets his first lemon tonight. <gasps> Don't worry. You can watch The Bachelor tonight because I have a new and improved remote that actually works that you can press Beautiful. the buttons on and do, 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 and it'll change the channels and guess what else? What? It'll turn up the volume too. Yes! Our other remote broke. How long have we lived here? And it probably broke a few months ago even in our old place. So. That just goes to show how much TV we actually watch and how much YouTube we actually watch. I just told him. Isn't oh, that yeah. crazy? Yeah. That is crazy. We're on the same wavelength. <laughs> let's give our let's give our baby the first lemon. Dinner has been consumed and dessert has arrived. Jackson, your dessert is here. I hope you are ready because the fun for us is about to begin. <laughs> He's probably gonna be like, ooh, that's yummy. I wonder if he since he he is a little bit older than when you know most people do this, and he just ate, so I wonder if he won't react to it like, you know. I wonder what his reaction will be. Yeah. And there's only one way to find out. Want a bite? Mm. He's thinking about it. Take a bite. Hey, turn this way. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you turning away from me? Let's get you some help. There you go. <laughs> oh, darn it. He, it. he keeps grabbing for Oh, there it goes. <laughs> you can have it. He's like, this is a trick. You guys are tricking me, huh? Okay, give him one more bite. Okay, one more. Okay. Oh, oh, that was good. One more. No, I think that's a no. That was kind of cute. That was cute. Yeah, we got a little cute. reaction. I think we will definitely do it earlier for when baby two comes. Oh, oh <laughs> I missed it. No. Do it again. Take another bite. Do it for daddy. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like the avocado face when I gave him yeah. an avocado for the first time. Oh, you're so cute. Ellie's favorite time of the year is here. Ellie cannot wait. She has an hour and a half left, but she is literally dancing in her little pants for The Bachelor. The Bachelor is on tonight. There is one guy, 25 women. Chris Hansen, I'm coming for your job because I think I can do a lot better than you can. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight on The Bachelor, blah, 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 blah. What do you think? I think you would rock it. I would rock it. Chris Hansen? No, Chris, Chris Harrison. Harrison. Chris Hansen is the night, the... The guy who catches, to catch a predator. I don't want his job. I do not want his job. Chris Harrison, tonight on The Bachelor. I could do it. I could do it. I could do it. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight is the night. As you can see here behind me, The Bachelor has begun. Are you so excited? <laughs> oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> I remember probably the past, what, how long have we been married? Five years. Ellie has watched The Bachelor, The Bachelorette, and sometimes The Bachelor Pad, is that what it's called? Yeah, sometimes, always. Always, <laughs> never missing a season. Ellie's favorite is when they all come in and she picks who she thinks is the best one. She's like, oh yeah, Ashley's gonna win. She's gonna be awesome. She's gonna do great. Ashley, she's gonna win. I like Ashley. Yeah. 
Do you know anyone from the show yet? Has they even started yet? No. Is that... It's bonding him over to watch it with me. I don't know, maybe and it doesn't start for another hour. Because they're oh. doing interviews. I don't care about interviews. I know. But it'll be fun. Okay. I'm going to let you guys do your thing. Right. You do your thing. And I'm going to do my thing. And it's probably going to be edit the vlog. I think we'll end it right now. Is that okay? I think that's probably Okay. Guys, thanks so much for watching today. I hope you had a wonderful day. And I think we might have an announcement coming up soon. Can you guys guess what it is? <gasps> We're pregnant! Oh. <laughs> oh, I was like, seriously, I was like, it's a boy! <laughs> no, that's not it. It's Stay not tuned. Stay in tune. We have an announcement coming up soon. Okay, we'll see you later. Bye! Bye.